but do it. But you have to understand what is the reason or purpose punching the bricks or breaking the tiles. Please tell me. Okay. As you, I, I'm glad to your children are doing another martial art too. So whatever they do, they must know what part of a body or how they conditioned it. So when, where to use it. So like, you know, for example, people think that you're asking me to punch. Punching is concerned. I think boxer have got tremendous punches. That's why when I met the Muhammad Ali, I respect him. I like him. You know, he's the world greatest heavyweight boxer. But public, they don't understand. You know, they try to compare him. They say, no, no, no. It's different. Boxer's fist, taekwondo fist. Taekwondo fist is developed as your human you know, natural human weapon movements. So whenever you are born with, you got right to look after the, you know, defendable. So you got the able to use human self-defense weapons. So that is a big difference. So when I ask, you know, Muhammad Ali, it's a good opportunity. I know you are four years younger than me, physically much bigger than me. So we like to have a, you know, Try have a fun. So after dinner, I said, I was going to punch the brick wall. So I said, he knows he didn't toughening as like us. So I said, are you kidding? So I said, no, just have a fun. So he come and punch the brick wall. Then, come on, world heavyweight champion boxer. Come on, punch it a little bit harder. So I said, he punched it a little bit harder. Oh, <laughs> so I said, look, that is the boxer's fist. But this is now different. I like to show the taekwondo fist. Now I'm going to show. Which, which one is it you say? Who I don't know which one. No, I'm starting to get a bit anxious as to what damage might actually be, be door, caused. Yeah. So it might have to be the door. Okay. Okay. Okay, look. Yeah. See? Oh, that's hurts. See? See? So, 